Vanessa, you have three minutes for your opening statement. Thank you so much for the opportunity to speak here today. My name is Vanessa Warheit. I use she, her pronouns. I am a Bay Area native, a mother, a small business owner, and a public advocate for equitable climate solutions. Two years ago, I moved to El Cerrito from Berkeley, both cities on occupied Least John Ohlone territory. Last year, I graduated from the Emerge California Candidate Training Program, and I'm now running for El Cerrito City Council. I have spent decades advocating and working for urgent, necessary change, and the crises just keep mounting. We now face a housing crisis, a water crisis, a climate crisis, a global pandemic, an epidemic of gun violence, an inequality crisis, a women's health crisis, and threats to the very foundation of our American democracy. It's a lot. On top of all that, El Cerrito, my new home, has been in a fi financial crisis since 2019, and our bond rating has now dropped to just one step above junk status, leaving us ill-prepared to adequately and equitably address these many crises. But I'm not afraid of big challenges. I've been working on the climate crisis since 2011, and I have pulled off things that people said couldn't be done by having the courage to address the root causes of problems by building broad, strong coalitions, by leveraging multi-solving solutions that solve many problems at once, and by daring to dream big. Since 1995, I've run a small business, so I understand the lived realities of small business owners and the value they bring to our communities and our economy. Since 2018, I've worked in climate finance and state level policy, and I've seen firsthand how corporate interests often override the interests of communities. As someone raised by a single mom who was the first in her family to go to college, I know what it's like to be housing insecure. I've been evicted twice when my family's home was put on the market and sold out from under us. As a recent first time homeowner, I understand also what it's like to have a mortgage and property taxes to pay. I am running to represent all the people of El Cerrito, whether black, white, brown, not special interests. I am the only clean money corporate free candidate in this race and the only candidate so far to have signed the no fossil fuel money pledge. So I thank you again for the invitation for spending your Saturday afternoon here and I welcome your questions. Thanks.